My name is Randy Bigley. Joining me on the podcast is Jesse Ferner. She's from the Bucyrus Area Chamber of Commerce. Good morning. Good morning, Randy. Thanks for having me today. Well, anytime, anytime. Uh, what's going on? I mean, you guys, I'm always hearing you have a, uh, a ribbon cutting somewhere or something. I mean, it seems like you have a lot of those lately. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff going on. Lots of new businesses opening in Bucyrus and places celebrating anniversaries. Mm -hmm. And one of those places is a one-year anniversary this Saturday at Ignite 365 Outreach. They are going to have a ribbon cutting to celebrate their one year. And then following that, there will be an open house and some mingling and then a potluck dinner followed by the worship bands are going to play. Okay, sure. So it should be a good time. It starts at 3 o'clock. Ignite th uh, 365 is at 111 North Poplar Street. So feel free to come on down and help us celebrate with them. Oh, yeah. And that's our most recent ribbon cutting. But we've got a year's worth of events scheduled oh, as do you? well. Oh, wow. You guys schedule that far ahead of time, right? We do. Well, we did this year. Yeah. I'm trying to plan my year out uh, so I know when to best uh, take vacations mm -hmm. and look and make sure I can make it to my daughter's football game. Sure. She's going to be a senior, you know. So yeah, right. I'm trying uh, to resolute in 2022 <laughs> to be a better planner and get a little more organized, Randy. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I know what you're saying. I mean, so I'm right there with you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. So what's happening? What, what is coming up here in the near future that, that you could talk about a little bit? Um, well, after everyone joins me at the ribbon cutting, um, I would love for you to join in on our spring auction. Mm -hmm. That's an online auction that we're doing this year. It starts um, the first week of April, April 3rd through the 10th. Um, right now I'm collecting donations, and those don't only have to be from member businesses, but any business that wants to kind of get their name out there a little bit by helping support the chamber and even individuals. Last year we had a lot of local artists that donated their artwork and so that was really cool and I know for a fact that some of that artwork that was purchased is hanging in businesses mm -hmm. and offices and public places so it's a neat little way to get your name out there if that's your niche. Wow, okay. Yeah, and then um, we're also planning our pub crawl this year, mm -hmm. the theme is going to be putting around B-Town. Okay. So folks are encouraged to bring their putter, and we'll have some various locations. We'll be stopping at member businesses. Uh, Steve Knapp up at the Copper Irons is in the process of building some putting greens for me. Oh, great. To take around, so that's going to be a lot of fun. It sounds like it, yeah. Yeah. Um, our next scheduled event, and I stress scheduled, is the cemetery walk. Mm -hmm. Now, I need actors. Mm -hmm. So I scheduled this on Mother's Day. Again, looking at the calendar, that seemed to be a good day. And in my head, I thought, you know, moms like to go to the cemetery walk. Why don't they go and possibly visit their mothers or grandmothers or folks that they might have in their fam family lineage? Or just have a nice stroll with your mom through the cemetery. I would sure. still like to do that if possible. But folks, if you know somebody willing to act, please have them get a hold of us. It could be... Um, so, oh, I should explain, it will only be mothers portrayed okay. in the Mother's Day Cemetery Walk. So we want to give a little mom some love, um, shine the light on them a bit. So it doesn't have to be a woman actress because the person can be a son, brother, father mm. of the mom whose story they are telling. Okay, sure. So t in an effort to encourage more actors... Mm -hmm. We don't care. Anybody, if, you, if you've got the kahunas to act, <laughs> come on right. down. Right. It's not very stressful. It's not super pressureful. I know that's not a word, but I like to use it anyways. <laughs> yes, yeah. yes. So please do come down to the cemetery walk if we get enough actors and we have it. Okay, sure. Okay. Would you like me to keep going on into summer there, Randy? You want to go a couple more to summer? Let's do that. All yeah. right. Yeah. All right. My man. Well, <laughs> everyone's heard of First Fridays. Right. We're going to have those this year. Awesome. We're very involved in that, too. So. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Very excited. The first one is June 3rd, and then we have the 1st of July, and then August 5th. It's hard to believe that's not very far away, really. It's not. It's not. They'll be no. here before you know it. Yeah. I'm sure one of us could Google how many days till Christmas, and it yeah. would blow our mind. Well, we're recording this on March 1st, so two months away. Is the first Fridays, indeed. Yes, yeah, it is. Yeah. Indeed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. wow. Be I'm here before you know it. <laughs> it's crazy, isn't it? Yeah. Then, then my kid's going to be a senior, and yeah. she's my youngest. <laughs> so, yeah, if we could pause <laughs> just for a little bit, that'd be great. But right. I would pause in the summer, not right, right now. Right. Speaking of summer, first Fridays. Yeah. Um, we have a few different churches and nonprofits that are going to be setting up at Shines this year. And um, 
So you can go and visit them and then all of our regular awesome festivities. I'm sure FC Bank will be setting up one of their awesome bounce houses and whatever great thing they have going on on the square. So you'll want to check that out. Um, so we'll see everybody at First Friday. And then we have Music at the Mural. Our uh, Chamber Summer Concert Series will be coming back. That starts June 2nd. Okay. Those are always on Thursdays. Every other Thursday at Shines Art Park from 7.30 to 9. Um, we're going to be featuring the Rolling Hams, the Hobo Band. Uh, 60 Days to Play opened up mm -hmm. for us last year. That's a local younger band. And they have shortened their name to 60 Days. Okay. Just 60 Days. Okay. Um, they'll be opening up again for us this year. We've got Mark Fisk's project, mm -hmm. Through the Wall. They're going to be taking up one of the slots. Perfectly Damaged will be returning if mm -hmm. you're a metalhead and you want to listen to that kind sure. of stuff. Yeah. Um, so be sure to stop out every other Thursday. It does not conflict with the Bratwurst Festival okay. at 7.30 to 9 at Shines Art Park. Nice, nice. Yeah. Yeah. And then following that, we've got a golf outing in August, the Route 30 Business Expo, which we collaborate mm -hmm. with Wyandotte and Galleon Crestline Area Chambers on, our annual dinner in November, and then on into Christmas stuff. Wow. Yeah, can you believe that? And I'm going to be here before you know it. It'll just fly by. It really, <laughs> really will. Oh, wow. So. Chamber, real quick, uh, when somebody hears, uh, mm -hmm. they've heard the term Chamber of Commerce, mm -hmm. what, what do you do? What, what, uh, what does the Chamber of Commerce do? Well, our motto at Bucyrus Area Chamber is bridging business and community. Mm -hmm. So that's a literal interpretation. Uh, we do help get businesses that positive promotion, help their companies make a positive impact um, on our community. Um, we do a lot of preferred referrals and advertising packages that are discounted from what you might normally be able to get. Um, this year, we've unleashed our new sponsorship package, okay. which for the first time ever is an annual sponsorship. So all of those events that I listed in the past, you would have one company or business, sometimes repeat year after year, mm -hmm. that would get a sponsor that event solely. And so I wanted to shake it up a bit, and some other chambers have done this as well, where we have different levels of sponsorship that last throughout the whole year. So instead of having one business get all the glory for their one event that they sponsor, we have, we've offered to all membership. Mm -hmm. And so um, members that want to sponsor some events, they don't get just one, they get the whole year worth of events. So our top levels of annual sponsorships, our one ask method is what we're calling it, include all of those events that I just listed. Very nice. Yes, all right. yes. That's available for just uh, about another week. Okay. So get a hold of the chamber if your business or individual wants to support our efforts. And uh, we'd love to talk to you about it and help you out. Well, Jesse, do you have a website? We do. It's really hard to remember. Okay. UcyrusOhio.com. Easy <laughs> enough, right? That's right. So if they want to know what's going on, check that out, right? Check it out. We're getting ready to go through a little overhaul. We're going to be getting a new website here pretty soon. So it might be best to scope out Facebook to okay. keep because it's super easy to update, obviously. So you can scope that out. And real quick, I just want to run down yeah. the list to Go finish ahead. your initial question of what we do and what businesses get. Um, ribbon cuttings, like I mentioned, mm -hmm. um, anniversary parties, all that good stuff, remodels. We love to throw parties for you. Mm -hmm. uh, there's lots of networking and education opportunities throughout the year, like the events I just listed. Every member gets a social media post during the year. So that's mm -hmm. um, going to be on our LinkedIn, which is coming soon, Facebook and Instagram preferred referrals when any customer or other member contacts the chamber needing anything. I just got a message while sitting here during this podcast, a member business asking for a cleaning service. Yeah, okay. So Songbird Cleaning, Miss Lori Brown, I'll be giving you a call. <laughs> All right. All right. <laughs> um, joining the chamber, you yeah. get a stronger Google presence. We have the keywords and algori algorithms and really smart people that know about that stuff talking to you, Hello Marketing, yeah. that handle that for us. We offer notary services, copier and fax services. Uh, our members can provide swag at all of our events, mm -hmm. so if they want to give out the free, you know, cups, the free pens, all that good stuff, they can use it. We have flexible use of our conference rooms. So, Randy, if you ever yeah. want to meet with your brokers in London yeah. or anything oh, at sure. all, you can come down. <laughs> yeah. We'll get you scheduled. You can use our conference room. Nice. Uh, we have group ratings with Anthem. A lot yeah. of folks take advantage of the health insurance discounts. And then we are building a member-to-member -member discount program. So we are in the process of putting that together where, say, um, if I work something out with Claudia, a new customer for her that is a member of the Chamber of Commerce might get a discount or free commercials or something out of that. 
And I knew Sue, I know that Sue up at Norton's yeah. is going to give us five bucks off of okay or nice. free rose for nice. chamber members. Awesome. So stay tuned for that. Fine. And thank you for letting me ramble. Oh, you're ramble, fine. Jesse, I appreciate you coming <laughs> in. Thank you so much. Absolutely.